Coming reinforcements. Figures. Hello. Brothers, where are you? Do a sweep. Ross and Fraser might still be here. Come on, show yourself. We know you are here. Hang on. this time. You handed yourself on. All things considered. All things considered. That's high praise coming from you. It is. Mountains and make them. Yes and yes. Hey, just so you know, Nathan Drake is no longer in the picture. You don't have to worry about him. I had my concerns. Why do you accept my offer? I'm not one to look a gift horse in the mouth, especially with everyone wanting to see me fall. I hear that. But on the plus side... Oh, there's a plus side? Oh, when people have low expectations, it's much easier to take them by surprise. As far as I'm concerned, this business is tough enough on your own. You have to take any advantage you can. You always worked alone? Mostly. How old were you when you started? Young. Learned quickly enough I needed to let people think they were getting their way. And then I could get the up. Oh, over there, in that cliff wall. See that archway? Looks intact. You coming with? Feel like stretching my legs. <laughs> Rightio. What is this place? You got me. <laughs> well, will you look at that? Monkeys. You seem excited. I like monkeys. Looks like there's something in the structure there. Yeah, monkeys. Besides monkeys. <laughs> what have we here? Let's see. Is it just me, or does that look like a map? It looks like our map. Huh. I'll just jot that down. Another crest of a Hoysala king. Someone went to a lot of trouble to hide this. What about the symbols up there? Symbols? There's a slot. Just the right size for a token. Let's give it a whirl. They filled up the spots on the map. Yeah. Wonder what happens if we find them all. Those figures must be the old Hoysala kings. Eleven, all in all. This is going to help us get the task. Hitchhikers, shoot! Oh, you're no fun. What, you want them shitting all over the seat? Look safe. Smell safe. Let's go. All right. And we were talking about... Oh, right. And then I could get the upper hand. Too subtle for me. I always prefer the direct approach. Yeah, whatever works, I say. The 
watch it. I think Asov's men had that sight too. Hey, look. Shiva's axe. Shiva. It was the god of destruction, right? Yes. But maybe not in the way you're thinking. Not literal destruction, then? That, but also in a more positive sense, like losing the ego, ditching bad habits. Shedding old attachments. Exactly. This should do the trick. Salah versus the tiger. Salah won, actually. He was protecting his guru and killed the animal in one blow. It's where the name Hoi Salah comes from. Hoi, meaning strike, in their language. No, 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 no! Oh! <coughs> Reza! You're coming to you okay? <coughs> yep. Come on in. Water's fine. I mean, don't drink. They've left their climbing gear. They should come in handy. Correction. Our climbing gear. Yeah. Oh. God, a bit hard on the wrists. than most men. I thought we were talking about coffee. We are. You <laughs> bastard. You 
You okay? Slightly deaf, but I'm good. Good. Let's keep moving. Oh my. What the hell is this? Okay, let's see what this does. That statue moved. Well, let's see how this goes. Well, I'll be going to hell. That's elaborate. Oh shit, statue moved. Look out! Ooh, that was close! I think that did it. Come on over. Coming. Oh, for goodness sake. Three statues with two different symbols now. A star and the So good. Nice to see you, Shiva. Right. Let's turn the water on. Well, well, what's to say it's not different this time? What if it's fire or something? You're messing with me. I'm totally messing with you. <sighs> Here we go. Hmm? Oh. I'm a little disappointed it wasn't fire. Another waterfall. Yeah. Two out of three now. Ross and I went to an absurd amount of trouble to hide the tusk. Well, the tusk was the symbol of Hoysala dominance, representing their wealth and their might. A nice trophy for the Persians. Yeah. My dad always thought that the tusk was something even greater, though. What? Your dad was after the tusk? Oh, my dad was obsessed with it. He spent every day and night researching it. All our money wasted on fruitless expeditions. Heard that one before. Ugh. So what came of it? I don't know. 
Well, he sent me and my mum away. He said it was no longer safe. And off to Australia we went. <laughs> and now here I stand, on the outskirts of Halibadu. That's... pretty funny. And the last fort's resting in the lake bed. So that's the one with the bow. Australia. Your accent makes sense now. Yeah. Fraser's not exactly an Indian surname either. It was my mum's. Let's head back to the car. <laughs> 